Welcome back to our week four of the Sew Trees Quilt Along, where we are going to sew all the little trees and add the stars. Christmas tree. Last week we saw already the five large blocks. Now this week it's all about the little trees. There is not so much new to tell you because you already know all the basics of sewing the tree block. But there's a little trick I want to show you. Last week I draw all the marking lines, the diagonal lines if you remember. In this week that would be 80 marking lines to draw. There must be a faster way around. You might already know that trick when you use a tape or something else as a kind of guideline. So the guide should go straight to your needle and from there should be a straight line. I use the washi tape for mine. Now when you place your both pieces right sides onto each other and you would usually mark a diagonal line here instead Instead, you will bring the tip under your needle about here. And the end should be run on that guideline. You can't see the end exactly. You flip it a little bit over so you can really see the end. See, without marking, your diagonal line is now perfectly done and works when you flip it back and that way you are much faster doing all your 80 little pieces. Great, all the blocks are done and before we saw them together in rows and assemble the quilt top next week, we want to add the little stars here. You have already the fusible web on the stars and you can peel that off easily. Scratch on the backing paper and so you can easily rip it off. And then you will turn each star a little bit for more variety. So for example, I can press this one on like that. In the next maybe like that. And you do, of course, the same thing with the little trees and little stars. Now, when we have prepared all the stars, let's go to the machine for applique settings. I have the uh, same color as my stars in the thread on, in the bobbin. And now go with a blanket stitch. If your machine doesn't offer a blanket stitch, you can also go with a zigzag stitch here. So I like to start in an inner corner and then I just bring my needle into a corner point. Of course the stitch has a certain width and the tips of the star and a little bit smaller than the width of the stitch but that's okay. trees are sewn together. That was fast, wasn't it? Really fantastic. I can't wait to see your progress. Show us pictures on Instagram and Facebook with the hashtag SewStreesQAL and we will pick a winner for this week. We see each other next week again when we assemble the top and I have a couple of tips for quilting and binding for you. See you then! Mm -hmm.